If you venture out into the forest or regularly take hikes, you can't really complain or be surprised when you come across some large reptiles because technically you're on their turf. But what happens when they're on yours, slithering into your homes, sitting in your drains, or chilling on construction sites? Whether you find them in their natural habitat or in yours, one thing's for sure, you need to clean a certain. You need to get out your camera and film it. These things happen quite rarely, especially in places like the United States. Welcome back to Forever Green, where today we're going to check out 10 of the most giant reptiles ever caught on camera. Before we begin, we've got a question for you. Which is the world's longest poisonous snake? Is it the rattlesnake, anaconda, coral snake, or king cobra? Number 10. 17 foot Burmese python. Hunters on the prowl caught this python in the Florida Everglades. If there's one thing that Florida is known for, it's the sheer number of snakes, crocodiles, and weird, dangerous animals they have just walking about. Well, this one took the cake. This 17 foot python is the largest ever caught here. It could easily kill a full grown man and took about five people to control it. Good thing they managed to subdue it because Florida does have a Burmese python infestation that's ruining the wildlife in the Everglades. These guys eat anything that moves, from raccoons to alligators. They have caused so much destruction that there is actually an allowance for hunters to shoot these snakes as they please, and they even get paid for it. This 17-foot snake will fetch the hunters about $375. Number 9. Malayan Water Monitor this giant lizard was spotted on the shores of the Kalang River in Singapore. It was seen crawling into a hole and then going into the water, not really bothering anybody. These lizards usually grow to about six and a half feet, but estimates put this lizard at 10 and a half feet. They have a pretty extraordinary growth rate, so much that even seasoned zookeepers are still surprised by it. Hatchlings start out at 10 inches and can grow several feet in under a year. Also called the Asian Water Monitor, it is the most common lizard in South and Southeast Asia. They live close to the water and are found in India, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka, Laos, and Cambodia. They will eat just about anything they can get their jaws on. Fish, frogs, birds, crabs, even snakes. They are also known to eat turtles and crocodile eggs. Number 8. Nine-Foot Rattlesnake Remember when we said Florida is pretty famous for all the dangerous reptiles being found in the most unlikely places? Well, guess where this 9 foot long diamondback rattlesnake was found? In July 2017, Florida resident Kathy Terry caught a diamondback rattlesnake on her camera while on a hike with her husband. They were bird watching when this snake slithered towards them and she said the creature was long enough to take up three quarters of the width of a two lane road. If she hadn't spotted the snake when she did, she could have even stepped on it, which certainly wouldn't be without its consequences. She shared the video on her social media to caution the other residents to be careful when walking about. Wise advice, given how many of them are slithering about the state. And if you think that's huge, stick around for number one. Number seven, alligator snapping turtle. Firefighters in the Bozier Parish District in Louisiana removed this massive alligator snapping turtle from an open drain. One of the firefighters had to keep a firm hand on its tail as it was struggling to go back into the drain. He put all his weight on the turtle to prevent it from going back in. Here, you see the alligator snapping turtle opens its mouth wide, ready to bite down on anything and on full alert mode. One of the other fighters gives it a plank of wood to bite on as it gets dragged away. Yeah, you definitely don't want to be bitten by these guys. They have a bite force of 1,000 pounds, meaning they can bite right through a bone and take your finger clean off. These giant turtles are native to freshwater areas in the United States and are the largest freshwater species in America. They generally reach well over 100 pounds, and this one was a whopping 290 pounds. It isn't even the largest one ever caught though. Some unverified records show that a 400-pound alligator snapping turtle was found in Kansas in 1937. We have no way of proving that, but we do have video evidence of this one. Number 6. Reticulated Python in a Theater Company Though native to Asia, 
These snakes are excellent swimmers and have often been spotted far away from their homes. Though this one may have strayed a bit too far. In 2011, a 25.2 foot long, 158 kilo reticulated python was discovered in Kansas City, Missouri. Officials estimated the age of the python to be around 10 years old. They couldn't very well leave it out there for anyone to come across, and a theater company took a shine to the creature. It was adopted by Full Moon Productions of Kansas and named Medusa. She is currently the longest snake in captivity. She consumes rabbits, deer, and hogs once every two weeks and can manage a good 40 pounds in just one sitting. Number 5. Nile Crocodile Take a quick glance at the crocodile entries in any trophy record. You'll find that a majority of them come out of Lake Chamo in Ethiopia. In fact, the four most massive crocs and six out of the top ten come from here. The largest of them was caught by Patrice Fay, a herpetologist who was studying and investigating this 18-foot-long Nile crocodile he named Gustav. There was even a film made on it called Capturing the Killer Croc, and it aired on PBS in 2004. Gustav was known to be a man-eater and was notorious for killing close to 300 people from the banks of the Razizi River and the north shores of Lake Tanganyika. The real number can't be verified, but one thing is for sure, Gustav is feared in the region. He weighs more than 2,000 pounds and might be about 60 years old. Clearly, that hadn't slowed him down. Gustav is also known for the three bullet scars on his body. The right shoulder blade has also been pretty severely wounded. Patrice isn't sure what caused this, but it could well be a scuffle in the water or a fight gone wrong. As for the bullets, we could assume someone was trying to defend themselves. What is interesting is, though size is nearly always an advantage in the animal kingdom, that doesn't seem to be the case for Gustav. Scientists and herpetologists who have studied Gustav say that his uncommon size and weight actually lessens his ability to hunt his usual prey, all of whom are agile. Now crocs like a steady diet of antelope and zebra. But because Gustav is slower, he is forced to go for hippos and large wildebeest, sometimes even humans. Number 4. 8-foot-long King Cobra A video of a King Cobra slithering into a home went viral and got 2 million views on social media. It was posted by a Facebook user named Derek, and it shows the snake coming out of a shoe rack outside the home. It then slowly moved towards the main door and tried to enter the house through the openings in the grill, but the door was shut and locked. Not to be deterred, this 8-foot-long Cobra kept climbing up till it found a small opening and entered the house through it. Fortunately, no one was home at the time, but can you imagine if they were? The fire and rescue department was called, but plot twist, the cobra couldn't be found. Anywhere. It was just gone. We hate to leave you hanging, but there really is no other update on the situation. We just hope everyone's safe. And to answer the question we asked at the beginning of this video, which is the world's longest poisonous snake? Is it the rattlesnake, anaconda, coral snake, or king cobra? It's the king cobra. Did you get it right? Number 3. Leatherback Sea Turtle In 2018, a group of fishermen caught a massive 1,100-pound, 10-foot leatherback turtle in the Philippines. They promptly released it back into the ocean, but not before taking their fill of pictures and videos. The leatherback sea turtle gets its name from its unusual shell, composed of a layer of thin, tough, rubbery skin, strengthened by tiny bone plates that make it look leathery. Leatherbacks were plentiful in every ocean except the Arctic and Antarctic, but have recently seen a decline. It is a vulnerable species now due to poaching and ingestion of plastic and pollution in the oceans. They like to feed on jellyfish, and a plastic bag underwater can sometimes look like jellyfish, so they go all in. Once they ingest it, it can rupture their internal organs or cause intestinal blockage, forcing them to starve themselves until they die. Even if they manage to survive, the plastic makes them unnaturally buoyant, and their ability to grow and reproduce is stunted. If you ever needed motivation to start using paper and cloth bags and reusable cups, this is it. It is now time for our subscriber pick. Remember, if you see something interesting or bizarre on the internet, make sure you send it over to us. We'll investigate and might even feature it in a future video. This time, we have two picks, one of a man holding a giant king cobra and the second of an alligator. We looked for reports, 
news articles, anything that mentioned animals of this incredible size, and we think you'll like what we found. Number 2. Yellow Anaconda Found in a Cave What would you do if you were just doing your job on a regular day and came across a 33-foot anaconda? Well, you couldn't do much. These workers at a construction site in the Altamira Caves in Brazil were conducting a controlled explosion to blow away some of the debris. When the dust settled, what they found shocked them. Amongst the rubble was a 33-foot, nearly 900-pound yellow anaconda. It was probably chained to a crane and lifted from the ruins. Yellow anacondas are actually native to South America, so that wasn't the surprising part. It was the sheer size of it. They're non-venomous, but that doesn't make them any less deadly. Yellow anacondas are constrictors, which means they coil around their prey and hold them tight until the prey suffocates to death. They don't always go the suffocation route though. They usually prefer to attack them from the water, so their victims more often drown than suffocate. They'll eat anything they can catch. Really, fish, amphibians, capybara, and even other snakes. The workers in this situation were in actual danger because a snake this size could definitely unhinge its jaw enough to eat a man. But luckily, all the workers there were unharmed. Before we look at number one, we have a quick challenge for you. In the next five seconds, go ahead and subscribe to the Forever Green channel and click on the bell icon to get notified when we upload next and you will have 25 years of fantastic luck. Try it, it works. Number one, Lolong the Saltwater Crocodile. Lolong was an Indo-Pacific crocodile captured in 2011. To date, the largest croc ever captured and placed in captivity. He was caught in a Bunawan Creek in the Philippines with the help of a government unit and crocodile hunters. He measured at 20 feet and three inches with a weight of 2,370 pounds. It took about three weeks to hunt and catch him and about a hundred people to pull him out of the water and onto land. He became aggressive, understandably, and broke any restraining ropes before he was properly secured, but this was not just for sport. Lolong is thought to have eaten a fisherman who went missing and eating a 12-year-old girl whose head was found only two days earlier. He was also most likely eating seahorses in the area. When they examined the contents of his stomach, they found remains of water buffaloes, but no humans. So, false alarm. But they couldn't just leave the croc to go back into the water, so they put him in an enclosure. Despite his initial aggressiveness though, Lolong was quite the gentle giant in captivity. I guess if you get three free meals a day and don't have to hunt yourself, you chill out a little. Many animal rights foundations argue that Lolong should have been released where it was found, but the residents of the area worried that it would put them all under threat. Sadly, he died just 18 months later in 2013. Reports reveal he died from congestive heart failure and liver and kidney failure. He was 50 years old when he was captured, and the usual for a saltwater croc is 70 years. And those are the 10 largest reptiles ever caught on camera. If you ever come across them, you might want to back away very, very slowly. They are not to be messed with. If you enjoy this video, Make sure you hit the like button and check out other videos on the Forever Green channel.